Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Barry Tone. And today, guys, I'm about to show you a tutorial how to get the best settings in Pokemon Sword and Shield while you're playing on PC with the Yuzu emulator. Yes, I'll be going um, detail by detail how to get the best settings, how to get the best quality possible playing with these games on PC. Now, before we get started, uh, I just need one thing from you guys before we start the video. Please, 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 please leave a like and also subscribe to the channel if you want to see more content like this in the future. Please, guys, just leave a like and subscribe. Only takes like two seconds. Just do it because I'm probably the next two months this probably may be my last time making emulation content as a whole because overall i noticed that each time i make emulation content the there's too much backlash towards my channel like it's it's really annoying that so as soon as i make one little emulation video it gets big and then i'm on People like it's it's really annoying how if I make one little emulation content video, it comes back to my channel essentially. Like everything I do, I get watched for. So like if you know what I'm talking about, you know what I mean. So if you want to see more emulation content in the near future, guys, please leave a like and subscribe. Cause if you guys do that, I have no problem with you. I have no problem making more videos like this more emulation content because videos like this, I know it's going to be helpful to you guys. So enough of me rambling. Um, first things first, we're going to start with the, the configure tab, like the basic, 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 basic stuff. Um, general, I'll leave this here. System, nothing. Uh, to get the best performance possible, I say use this shader cast. Use the GPU emulation, and uh, you can put it 30 FPS. Put it there. Even if you don't click on 30 FPS, the game is gonna be on 30, 30 FPS because Pokemon runs at 30 FPS. It's, it's just how game how the Pokemon Company Game Freak make their games. So yeah, that's basically it. That's this is basically the basic settings to get good, the best performance as possible. And after that, you just press OK. And it worked from there. Now, I'm going to be downloading a couple of things to make the performance even better. Example, high, le high resolution trees, like the trees are fixed in the wild area. Um, I will leave in the description down below to all of these things so I'm going to be setting I'm showing sure you guys how to set all of these up so you guys don't need to worry high resolution trees outlines remove exp disabled another high resolu resolution mod but this is for like the towns and stuff like that which is cool and another sharpen texture so like stuff like the ground is fixed the ground looks more colorful um, the wild area looks more colorful, like, cause it looks really bland and stuff like that. You guys can check out the screenshots, but I'm not going to click in on the screenshots. I'm not trying to get this video clean, but anyways, um, we're going to download the tree mod. So I'm going to do first. All right. So I'm going to go simple, easy with this one. Close that one real quick, but minimize it. Open up the tree mod. All right, so click on this titles. When you get right here, when you get right here, this go on this. Uh, open mod that location. And then you're going to rename it F trees, basic fix tree 
fix. Something simple and easy as that tree fix. Let's call that the tree fix mod. And then we're gonna minimize this in the meantime because we're gonna be getting more stuff. All right, also use the outline mod. which I'll leave in the description down below. I'm gonna manually download. I'm gonna download this again. All right, quick download. Minimize this again. All righty. I'm gonna open up this. You're gonna look for the ABDF one, which is that's for sword. Cause I know most of you guys are playing sword. And then you're gonna move this to the side real quick. I hit that. Close this real quick. You're gonna rename this no I no outlines essentially. No out lines. So that mod is good. So you, when you play, you're gonna have high resolution trees, no outlines, EXP share. I'm gonna do that later. I'm gonna do this one next. I'm gonna manually download this. This is this HD sharpen. It gives that that true that true 1080 or even 4K if you can play it on your emulator. That's essentially it. I'll just wait for this to load up real quick. I have tested all of these out. They all work. Um, you can also this do this for your custom firmware switch also, which I may make a video on later on this week but it depends how you guys feel about that um get out this one too is that so this is the third one we're installing go right here install the wrong fps Bam. yeah as long as it has the wrong fps I think we can rename it. Open mod data location again. I mean, yeah, sharp textures. Sharp text. I'll just call that basically, just make it short, sharp text. Cause you want it to be seen under properties. We do all that stuff. Oh, this is high. <laughs> My bad, guys. It's high res. You gonna name this high res? High res. The other one we're about to download is sharp textures. Yeah, sharp textures in a wild area. All that good stuff. Even sh like sharp textures and roots, towns, all that good stuff. After that, I believe EXP share is going to be the final. And I'm going to show you guys what settings you need to do to get the best quality possible to play in 4K. So it's, it's going to look like something like some really ultra beautiful stuff. Like next level gaming. <laughs> Graphics Game Freak that they should have given us. But the fans, we, the fans, the community had to make it ourselves, but it is what it is, right? Uh, um, FPS, let me make sure it has everything here. Yeah, it has this. Um. Oh, did the wrong thing. What was it? I think it was. Accidentally went too fast. Sharp textures. Uh, 
Uh, let me download it again. Not that big of a deal. Oh, it's right here. Cause I dragged it to my desktop. Alrighty. Um, for this one, I just I think I'm just gonna drag the ROM FPS. I don't think you need to rename it. If I do, uh, I just rename it. And close it right there. And then uh, no EXP. Yes, yeah, straightforward. No EXP. Everybody gets zero. Only the Pokemon first in your party gets the EXP, essentially. After that, we minimize this. Alrighty. There you go. Uh, we're gonna look for the sword one. I'm just gonna drag it. So right here, like I said, all this gonna be in the link down below. Make sure you guys check that out. And after that, we're gonna close it. And if you wanna play the game in 4K, forgot to show you guys with that real quick. Go under the graphics tab. Oh, never mind. The profile scanner option is not here, so let's go native. Yeah. I think I'll make a separate video how to play 4K because I thought the profile scanner option was here, but no, nah, it was not here at all. So I have to make a separate video for that to play this game in 4K if you want to play this game in 4K. So after that, let's press OK and then you want to go into under properties, make sure everything is on. Yeah, basically everything is on. Even though you guys don't see, I believe, oh my, that location. It's in like I think I need to rename this. Let's call it high for just now. Let's call it high. Even though you don't see one and two, it's still installed. Trust me, it's still installed. It just works weird with this emulator for some reason. Ah, I open my that location puts it on properties. Uh, when you go to properties, make sure everything is on. So, yeah, that's basically it. It's all you guys need to do to get the best experience possible playing this game on the PC. Um, like I said before, if you guys enjoy this video, find this video helpful at all, please, guys, leave a like. I would greatly appreciate it. And also subscribe. I would greatly appreciate it more if you guys subscribe because... You time I make videos like this, I gain a huge backlash repercussion making these type of videos on my channel. But yeah, I'm just making these videos in general because I know the community likes it and this is what the community needs. So yeah, that's about it. I see you guys in the next video. It's your boy's Bergtone signing out. See you guys in the next one. Peace.